have our next interesting question over here. A guarantee is a promise or assurance that attests to the quality of a product that is either given in writing by a manufacturer or given verbally by the person selling the product. Which situation below is the best example of a guarantee? Our options are given as Muller purchases a DVD player with the highest consumer ratings in the, its category. Our option B is the salesperson advises Kurt to be sure that he buys an air conditioner with a guarantee. Our option C is the local auto body shop specializes in refurbishing and selling used cars. Our option D is Lara buys a used digital camera from her co-worker who says that she will refund Lara's money if the camera's performance is not of the highest quality. So which of the following options explains us a situation that a guarantee does? So guarantee is nothing but a promise or assurance given by either the manufacturer or a person selling. So which of these situations explains or matches the definition that is given over here? That is what we have to find. Let us see what will be the answer. Our answer is option D. Lara buys a used digital camera for her co-worker who says that she will refund Lara's money if the camera's performance is not of the highest quality. So clearly from this statement you can say that Lara's friend is assuring her the quality of the camera. So the performance of the camera is guaranteed by Lara's friend. Hence our option D will be the answer. Let us move on to our next question. A tie baker is an additional contest or period of play designed to establish a winner among tied contestants. Which situation below is the best example of a tie breaker? Our options are given as At half time the score is tied at 28. Mary and Megan have each scored three goals in the game. Option C is the referee tosses a coin to decide which team will have possession of the ball first. The Sharks and the Bears each finished within 14 points and they are now batting it out in a 5 minute overtime. So which of these options depicts the situation of a tiebreaker. These pattern of questions appear in TCS, LND and SSC. Let us see what will be the answer. The answer is option D. The Sharks and the Bears each finished with 14 points and they are now batting it out in a 5 minute overtime. So you can clearly say that the Sharks and the Bears, each team, finished with 14 points. Hence there is a tie. And to break the tie, they are having a 5 minute overtime. So the additional period is to determine who will be winning the game. Hence our option D will be your answer.